confirm it was worth it. All that drive, all that horrible drive and the two flights. First crab of the trip. the day see for the day the sand is amazing is that nice no nice it's spooky oh wow so these sunbeds are 400 pesos for two you can also get wi-fi from one of these huts ah. it's 35 pesos one person said it's for an hour and one person said it for three hours so we'll confirm in a minute oh no We've lost an eye. There's no eyes. There's no eyes footsies. There he is. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Daddy taught you how to do this. We've got to bury mum alive. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hello. Are you eating the sand? Yeah. Nice. Are you a mermaid or a whale? Okay. I'm off to go and have a massage on the beach. This is so exciting. It's just up here. Hi. Wow. <laughs> what was your name? Gemeline. Gemeline. Yes. You have to come here and see her because she's amazing. We'd like to have a massage from her. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> oh my god, that was incredible! Tell me how good that massage was. The best massage I've had in the Philippines. Yes. God, look at it. I look like I've been on an island for about, <laughs> about 40 months. What do you want to do? Volcano. Make a volcano. It was actually really embarrassing because the massage had finished and she hadn't touched me in, in a few minutes. And I was thinking, she hasn't said it's finished, but... She hasn't, she's not touching me anymore. So eventually I opened my eyes and she was like, it's finished. I was like, oh, okay, thanks. Anyway, I've just made a rookie error because I've just come straight for the massage place. Oil on my skin, straight in the sand. Help. Second coconut of the day. American subscribers, this one's for you. No, no, what are these little oh. Filipino delicacies? Oh, what are they called? No, What's this? What is it? Fish. Fish backer. Uh, okay, okay, get your sandy little mitts out. Make it a bit bigger. <gasps> oh my goodness. Daddy, try. Oh, no, no, let's try. Fish Mmm. Oh. Nice. You like? Like it. Good. Like it. Oh, cheers. <laughs> <laughs> so you can play that guy. Hey, Baba. You okay? <laughs> you okay? Is that tiring? No, no, no this one, this one. That's the ladies. <laughs> Is that tiring? Oh, okay. Who's mummy? Who's mummy? Who's beach? Oh, she's in the beach. That is amazing. Right, I'm going to bring you down there with me. Look at this. 
Amazingly clear is this, and you can literally walk all the way out. But it's still so shallow. <laughs> oh, I just can't get over the view here, it's so nice. Lawrence wants to do that in a minute. So, basically there's one like main restaurant where you can get this food from, like where we had it this morning. That's where this is from. And there's also like snack bars and little shops as well. And loads of places you can get drinks, coconuts. It's very well set up. It's very, very well set up here. It's very comfortable, you can spend the whole day here. For anyone that wonders why boys are so spoiled when they're grown up, this is why. Ah. Sorry in advance, future partner of night. I don't know if the camera's getting it, but there's loads of dragonflies. Like loads. So we've literally been here all day. It's amazing. Absolutely one of the best beaches we've ever, ever been to. And now we're going to go to Leo Beach because apparently there's a great place to eat and a great sunset. for you about the beach. From El Nido, it takes, from El Nido town, it takes about 40, 45 minutes. You can get a tricycle for 1,200 pesos to take you there and back. Um, or you can rent a bike for about 400 or 500 pesos a day to get down there. Make sure you have crash helmets because the road is mental. It's so beautiful and a lot of the roads absolutely fine to get there, but the road that comes off to the beach, which is fairly long, is like rubble. When you get down there, they've got all stuff to eat. They've got shops, they've got snorkel stuff you can hire, ATVs you can ride on, Wi-Fi if you need it. Bring cash, because there is a cash machine, but it's in like someone's garden and it never works. So bring cash. And for El Nido in general, make sure you have cash. To go for a wee is five pesos. And to go for a shower is 25 pesos. And they're actually very, very clean. Apparently, I didn't go there, but Lawrence did. Oh, and a coconut, if you love them as much as I do, are a hundred pesos. And you can get beers, soft drinks, all the seafood. Basically, you can eat in the, uh, the restaurant that's there, or they'll take it to your sunbeds. Um, it, yeah, it's just absolutely beautiful. We had such a good day there. The beach is gorgeous. The sea is lovely, nice and warm. Perfect. <coughs> and you can walk out quite far and it's still quite shallow, so it's really good for kids. There's not big waves or anything. So, tomorrow we are going on a boat tour to the island hopping, which is supposed to be unbelievable. The day after, I think, we're gonna come back to here. This is Leo Beach. This has loads of stuff around it. And we're just like, oh my God, can't wait to explore this. We're gonna have some food. We're gonna watch the sunset. This is brilliant for sunset. And yeah, see you tomorrow. Oh, I'm going to go to the next one.